Hello and welcome again to my channel. My name is Pedro from Brazil. This is the second tutorial on my channel. I will show how, how I created the style for the song Don't Answer For Me of Alan Parsons Project. I will show a lot of new things about style creation, so keep listening. And of course, uh, subscribe to my channel. Okay, let's start. Go to menu, menu 2 style creator and initialize style okay it's the same as the first tutorial uh, this song we will keep the tempo to 114 115 and eight bars in the section a okay okay I changed the position of the camera because we will start to record the drums. I choose the pop drum kit because in the, the song we use this kind of symbol. It's right on the right of the keyboard. So turn on the timing and start. Eight bars. Okay, now we can go to channel edit, quantize, put the note, and execute. As you can listen, the this this, this thing corrects the tempo. Okay, now I will add the drums. First is the normal symbol, okay? Make the same operation, quantize, okay? Now I you are you at the kick pedal and the snare, okay? That's correct. Okay. Now I will add a second uh, the second snare in the last of the bar fourth and eighth. And quantize, but I will change the note because in the half of the bar. Okay, let's check. Okay, now I will add the Spanish sound. I don't know the English name, in Portuguese is Castanhola. Hold the rhythm one, choose the popular tin kit, complement to the sounds here, and let's record. Same thing, go to quantize. Now I will quantize in the, this kind of note. Let's check if, if everything is right. Okay. Finally, I will add a second snare in the, 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 the beat, the drum, okay? 
to make it stronger. Go to refund. Now I will show you how to use the step editor to add uh, a second, duplicate a note and change this, this note. Go to step editor. Every line is one of the keys. Here is the snare in the E1. Okay. And this, the other snare. I will add a more stronger snare on the fourth, the ending of each bar. Okay. So this is the snare. I want to duplicate. Go to insert. Now I have two snares. On the same time, I will change to to a stronger beat, like this one, okay? I will do this on one, on the bar one, bar two, here, bar two, search, change, bar three, E1, change, bar four, search, and change. Bar five. Here. Search. Change. Bar six. Here. Search and change. Seven. Search. And change. Finally, bar eight. Search. And change. Let's check. Let's save, save here. I will call tutorial two. Okay, now I will add the bass, hold the bass, select, I choose the active bass finger and let's record. As you, as you could see, I only use the C key. Uh, all when we are creating styles, we keep, have to keep in mind that we are in the C scale and we can use the C, C chords or C7 chords, okay? Uh, to check that, you can see on S, FF Edit, Source Root Chord. As you can see, is in C major 7. So everything you have to record, just put on this scale, okay? Let's save. And here. Tutorial 2. Now I will copy a uh, guitar from another style, okay? I will choose the... I will put this on the phrase one. Go to assembly, phrase one. I will copy from another style that I have a, a guitar, a nice guitar, from part C of this style. Okay, let's save and check. In the assembly, you can mix channels and tracks from other styles, very, very simple, okay? Let's check. Okay, now I will add the background piano. Hold on the chord two. I choose a DC7, pad production. Okay, I will use the entire, the first, third, fifth, and the seventh, okay, of the chord, the C chord, and I will add some other notes in the eight bars, okay? Let's do it. Quantize, 
quantize it. Let's check. Save. Okay. Nice. Now I will add a guitar. Stroke guitar. Go to chord one. I will choose the shadow lead. This is kind of new thing. You can go to SFF edit and choose guitar here, stroke. When you choose this option, your keyboard changed this track, chord one, to guitar mode. In the guitar mode, we, we can use six notes. Each one represents one string of the guitar. Okay, the first string, the second, the third, fourth, fifth, and sixth. So to make a stroke, we can use or let's do it. not nice check but when you save and play everything sounds right Finally, I will add uh, the phrase two. Will be a electric piano, the X midnight. now the phrase two again you have to put all in scale C C7 major chords Okay, let's check, save and check. However, the guitar is too loud, we have to adjust. Now and we will use the sliders, okay. So the rhythm one 75, 62, for rhythm two, the bass 65, the chords too loud, the guitar 45, 41, the piano 60. There's no pad in the main A, the phrase 180, the, the guitar, the bass guitar, and the DX Midnight 285. Save again. Let's check. I, I believe it's better. is not sound right. Why? 
because we have to change how we, uh, the, the feeling of the the phrase to go to ff here is root fixed he keeps the 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 note you are pressing the chord you are doing we have to change to root trends because when you change the chords the melody will accompany accompany the 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 chords okay let's here again. Oh, but it's too high. We can correct that thing. Again, choose the phrase to and go to high key notes and we will put the B flat. What is the high key? When you are doing your chords, when uh, chords higher than, than B flat will lower the sound. Let's check. Save. to decrease one octave go here step editor you can decrease and the second part e4 or e3 e3 Check again. We will pass to section B, put eight bars to. The B is the same as A, but we'll add uh, the pad, a chorus pad. So assembly and copy everything from man A, except the pad, because there is no pad on man, man A. Okay, now we will add a pad. Hold the pad button, I will choose the boy chorus. Oh and record. Let's save and check. I believe it's too loud. First, we'll put the pad to maybe seven. Yeah, okay. Save again. Let's. to record the C section, click and C, eight bars, two, I will copy everything from B, go to assembly, copy B, copy B, copy the main B, okay, the first thing to remove the phrase two, because you change 
the bass we will remove because we will, we will change to and the guitar we will change it to okay now I will record the bass from the C section I read a, a note uh, it's a little different a little bit different than the sections A and B some arpeggios so we have to change go to uh, chord one guitar arpeggio okay and the NTR NTT okay and let's do it said before these notes these keys can can be used one for each string let's up the guitar to six to more more power and keep the same in the others now we can hear better <laughs> Finally, we'll record the phrase two, uh, just a uh, few chords on electric piano. <laughs> C section, select the riff and tool, step editor, every snare, okay, here, I will add more power, as the same, but I will add the clap, and a tone, okay, Insert to duplicate, clap, insert to duplicate, and a tone. Same thing on every bar. save let's hear okay more stronger now we'll create the D section the D section eight bars two K 
okay let's copy from C except the main B because the, the drone is not harder anymore copy everything from C okay copying okay we have the D I will change the coral to from O to A okay and I will add uh, new things on the GX piano the midnight piano no it's the midnight piano this the, the X midnight okay let's add was wrong that's correct to GX midnight okay I will change the base to on this section and not use the, the the first note of the scale instead I use the fourth on the the bars one three one one two five and six check Adjust the sound. Okay. Phrase two. It's too loud to On C2. Save. Let's check the style of sections. All four sections. do the fill, fill way first, I will copy everything from main, main A, I will just add a, a snare and a tag smash on the drum, okay, here. this splash we can put on the end just on the end check okay yeah the fill B I will copy everything from fill A Few A, not man A, few A will be the same. I will just 
uh, I will just uh, the main few a but I copy the pad but I, I will delete because I don't don't want the pad in the fill. Let's save check a few a and few b okay how you create the few c few c go to assembly I will copy everything from man c make a different fill in go here and the refund the splash will add to the end okay First, I will add more stronger, yeah, and this one too. Save. Oh, I will quantize too. Let's check. Nice. And finally, the fill in D. I will copy everything from man D and fill E B on the, the drum. Everything from man D. Okay. And save. Okay. Now I will create the intro one. The intro one, I will put two bars. I will just copy the refund from man C, the stronger one. Okay. Just that thing. Let's check. Okay, I forgot to copy to the clap, the Spanish thing, the rhythm one from any section. Now it's okay. And finally, the last section, the intro 2, the second intro will be 8 bars, we will copy everything from man A, except the refund 2, that I will copy from man C, because it's stronger, okay, man A, man A, man A, there is no pad on man A. And I will not copy the phrase too because I will play it. Save. Okay. Uh, now I'm going to equalize the style, equalization. Just select the style, go to mixer and choose the style. Let's uh, hear the difference on the Spanish thing. You add more re reverb and chorus. Can you hear the difference? Yeah. More reverberation here. And the drums too.
save this configuration to the style, go to style creator again and save. Now the, the mixer, the mixing settings will be inside the style. Okay, now the style is ready to play. I will play some parts to understand. I will just put the pi piano here. Okay, let's play. Subscribe to my channel, share, and keep listening to it, okay? Thank you. Till next time.